Okay, hello everyone. Welcome back to Sembachin Studio. And for this video, I'm going to talking about how to use uh, UI navigation. That is the the control that you need to use in our application because we need to uh, make our application easy more than we did not use navigation okay so you know what is navigation what is navigation navigation in uh, Xcode is um, a control that you can get to make you easy to present your data and make it easy for the user to navigate that content yeah generally use this class but um, but you may also subclass to customize the class behavior okay so totally UI navigation is specialized view controller that manage the navigation of hierarchy content okay let me show you how to create a UI navigation okay uh, the first thing you need to do is go into the main storyboard As you can see you should see uh, your controller here and then what I need to do is uh, click on this icon and go into editor and embed in go to editor and you can go to the embed in can um, click on navigation controller here so the Xcode will generate link the navigation uh, controller to our view controller when we connect it already you 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 will see uh, this navigation controller and link by the segue to the navigation view controller so when you run it you will see this on the top of the view controller okay let's be done to see Yeah, uh, a navigation controller object manage the currently display screen using navigation stack, which is uh, represented by an array of view controller. And the first view controller in array is the root of view controller. And the last view controller in the array is the view controller current being display. All right. So you need to add and remove your controller from the stack using segway or using the method of this class. The user can also remove the topmost view controller use the back button in the navigation bar or using a left at gesture recognizer. Okay, as you can see this view controller is running so wait a little bit it is so here yeah one more thing is a uh, navigation controller manage the navigation bar at the top of the interface and an optional toolbar at the bottom of the interface and navigation bar is all the way present and is managed by the navigation controller itself which uh, update the navigation bar using the content provider by the view controller on the navigation stack when the is toolbar hidden property is equal 4 
data application controller similarly update the true bar with content provider by top module controller okay now uh, the simulator run completely so you will see this uh, uh, navigation bar on the top of your visual controller but don't have a uh, title because we didn't set it so let's go back to the, the view controller you can set by click on the top here and you can say here I can say uh, okay as you can see it will show on the top and yeah uh, one more thing is um, I want to create a, a, a new view controller to show how useful of the, the uh, navigation controller UI navigation controller okay uh, so I want to add more the navigation button okay yeah drag and put display and I can say I can change uh, add to the um, yeah I can say compost so um drag hold the control and drag to the view control second view controller I can say so so uh, the second view controller will add to the uh, navigation view controller stack as you know uh, this this is a uh, array of view controller yeah uh, navigation controller is is you can you can say uh, is an array of the view controller that uh, the first view controller is the root view controller and the last view controller is the the last the last uh, the last view controller is uh, currently being displayed okay so now I just run it because uh, when 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 you connect this to the scan view controller, you don't need to create a dismiss button because a navigation controller is handled it for you already. So let's be and run to see what happened and what it worked. Yeah, a navigation controller coordinate its behavior with it delegate object the delegate object can override the pushing or uh, popping of uh, view controller providing a custom animation transition and specify the preferred orientation for the navigation interface the delegate object you provide must confirm to the UI navigation controller delegate protocol okay okay uh, now our simulator is running so as you can see this is a uh, bar button item that I just add to the our navigation bar so you can click on it okay so so it will bring you to the the, the scan view controller here so you can click this to go back yeah all right when we use a navigation controller you don't need to to uh, write you don't need to create a dismiss button because when the scan view controller is in the stack of the, the navigation controller it will have a back button already so navigation is control is is handle it for you okay so you can click back button to back or you can uh, uh, gesture you can use gesture as you can see swipe so right this to go back yeah pretty awesome and pretty good to use because uh, have power is make this control to make you easy okay so um, yeah uh, like that so one more thing is um, 
if you, if you don't want to 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 solve this navigation, you can go to the main storyboard, and you can go to the navigation controller. You can hide it, hide navigation bar by go to the attribute inspector. You will see navigation controller here, and you can see a bar visibility, and you can uncheck so navigation bar. It will not show your your navigation bar. Okay, right. So uh, yeah, okay. I can delete this, so I can create a new button. Okay. Okay, uh, so now I need to drag this button to the second view controller. I can say so. So, okay. So now, as you can see, so it's mean push, push view controller. So this second, uh, this first view controller is uh, in the stack of the navigation controller, so it pulls. Uh, it pulls the second view controller to the, the the stack of navigation controller too. If you select the survey tie, yeah, using a push, so it will push the second view controller into the stack of navigation view controller. So what I need to show is uh, when I'm start start up my application, I don't want to show the navigation bar. So as I demo you, I uh, click to uncheck so navigation bar. So, but when I click this button, go to the second view controller, I want to show the navigation bar and with with back button too. So what I need to do is I'm going to create a, a second view controller to assign the class to it to to write a code to control the navigation bar. Okay, let me say go to file new and create a new file and I can say um, second view controller Okay, so now I need to um, yeah, I need to import UI kit and class and the instant of UI view control ex uh, extend from UI view controller and I can say view did load. Okay, one more thing I want to I want to assign this class to the second view controller in the in the Amanda storyboard. Okay, by click this icon and go to the identity inspector and I can say scan view controller. Okay, bingo. Okay, and let's get back to the scan view controller and I can say cell. I want to change background to separate from the scan view controller with the uh, first view controller. I say set up view dot background color equal to the uh, a gray color. So now, when the second view controller did load, okay, right? So I can say cell navigation controller dot s navigation bar is hidden equal to file. It's been a uh, 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 this property is uh, when it's true, the navigation navigation bar is is hidden. So when when it equal to four, the navigation bar is so. Okay. So let's be and run to see the result.
one more thing is um, I want to let you know about navigation controller view. A navigation controller is a container view controller. You know that? Yeah, I want you to make sure that you understand. Okay, uh, now our simulator is running. So I can click on this button. It should be bring me to the scan view controller with the uh, navigation bar show up. Okay, let me click it. Boom. Okay, as you can see, our uh, um, navigation bar is so, but we when we click back. So the purple controller will show the navigation bar to boom. Yeah, as you can see, because uh, when we show navigation bar, we not yet hide it. When we back to the the first view controller, so let's go to hide it before uh, 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 second view controller dismiss. What we need to do is um. Go to view, will disappear. You can say cell navigation controller dot is navigation by hit then equal to true. Yeah, all right. So let's be and run together. Okay, so now let's try to click it. Boom. Okay, let's click back. Boom. Yes. It's already hide an operation. Click again. Click back. Click again. Click back. Click again. Click back. Okay, thank you for watching. If you have any question, you can ask me below this video. And and uh, if you like it, please like this video and share to your friend or to your social media to help our channel. And one more thing is don't forget to subscribe our channel to get the uh, latest video and more updates. Okay, thank you. Goodbye and good luck.